up there on Flyboy Peoples, and let me tell you why I'm dope. One dope I'm drop show is nigga. crazy, man. He bringing you and you back to the city. So he making us work harder as artists. You know, he getting unity back to the city and to the artists. I like that feedback. It's gonna be crazy. He building a platform for everybody. I got some crazy music out right now. I'm about to drop another tape called Welcome Black Fly. I'm about to shut the city down with this one, man. You can find it on iTunes. Probably gonna drop it like in a couple weeks. I got a single I'm about to release. You know what I'm saying? Uh, do something just about to be a big year for us. That's how I'm gonna put it. You know what I'm saying? We're about to just break it to the industry. We're about to break it to the city. We're about to just show them how we coming in. You know, do something. We got a lot of changes that's been made, but we getting it popping. We got a lot of stuff going on. We got shop left. We got Davinino, we got Ray, we got Kirky McBurney, you feel me, we got, some, we got some crazy stuff going on, you know, plus we mixed in with Frontline, you know, Frontline Productions, so, the whole production team, we just about to lay it out crazy this year. And I didn't work with artists like Fred the God, Son, Wes Weeks, uh, Project Pacino, uh, young Skull, Shop Dad, Frank Fisher. Uh, it's, it's a crazy lineup. Man. I work with pretty much a lot of people in the industry, though, too. So, let's get it, man. Me fitting in, I don't believe I fit in with nobody because I'm my own entity. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm out here just doing what I do. You know what I'm saying? Trying to be the best of me. I don't really look at what other people are doing. I focus on what me and my cat are doing. That's it. I can really rap. This is what I do. I don't really think, you know, so I, I can do all of that shit. I don't put myself in one category. Everybody else, you know what I'm saying? Like, we is from the streets, but at the same time, we was raised off real hip hop and trap music. I don't talk about nothing we ain't do. We rap. My life is real. Everything we've been through is real. We don't fabricate nothing. You feel me? I don't think I took my style from nobody, but my influences was Tupac, Busy, Biggie, Jay-Z, Jeezy, T.I. You know what I'm saying? I listened to a whole bunch of dudes back in the day. Jam Master J, Rock Him. Salute to all the old school dudes, you feel me? That's where I got my style from. I don't think I too much fit in with what everybody else is doing. I like to do my own thing, you feel me? I got into the music scene basically because you know, I got stabbed up. But before this, I was losing a lot of friends and shit like that. I used to play ball, but we was in trouble. I was in and out of jail, fighting cases, uh, on probation. I never leave the state, but when I was able to leave the state and shit, I was, I was playing ball and ended up getting stabbed up and shit. So I'm like, all right, let me go ahead and, you know what I'm saying, put everything I've been through in one ball and shoot that motherfucker. So that's basically what I did. But everything I ever been through as far as me losing my brothers, my cousins, my friends, you know, problems we was going through in the hood, problems we was going through at home, and things I've seen. So I'm like, oh, shit, it's the best way for me to describe myself. Plus, I took the niggas out the street, so, you know what I'm saying? I am Flyboy Peoples, and this is Do Some Entertainment. You can find all my music on iTunes, any social media site, basically. I will be uploading to Got my own website, www.dosomethingent.com. Look for that for any updates, shows, uh, all of that shit. Dropping, dropping everything. This shit.